Hello, YouTube. Uh, I'm here with my beautiful wife. Uh, <laughs> I have my own channel, two channels, but um, I'm here as a guest today. He's a guest on my you channel know. today. It's very exciting to have you here sitting with me. Yeah. So uh, I support my wife and her, uh, her, um, her videos, her hair videos, her... Um, Just everyday uh, vloggy videos, right? Her blogging and her... Uh, Makeup and stuff like that. Yeah, you know what I love about you so much is you just let me be me. That's what I like about you so much. I love you so much. Not yeah. just like, like, not just like about yeah. you. I love what I love about you. He makes me, um, I just be myself. So when you see my little goofy videos with some lobster in my hand and a little bit of, uh, I, I did a video like that. You didn't see that one. He didn't see that video yet. I have a question. <laughs> was that my lobster? The yeah, it was your lobster. I did, I did a video about tuna and lobster. Oh, okay. Remember Jaquan said something about he wanted to turn his tuna in and lobster? Yeah. I did a video like that. And that was just me being silly. Okay. I don't think he's seen that video. I think he's seen all my other videos, no, but he didn't see the tuna and the lobster video. So, it was your lobster. Okay. Which he cooks really great food. So, you got to tune into his channel and watch him cook really great food. Okay. Feels good. <laughs> so, so, okay, so tell me this. Okay, now you're on your channel, and you know you're making videos, you know, but you see that that YouTube is taking away your subscribers and your views. But right, how do you feel about that? I don't feel good. Actually, I just made a video saying I was going to quit. Did you know about that? Uh -huh. I made a video saying I was about to quit. Well, you know what? You gotta understand. So we're Kirby's. We don't quit. You're right. We we, we keep on going no matter what happens. Yeah. You know? And I really appreciate some of the people that came in and said, you know, don't quit. Don't get, you know, keep going. Don't give up. And you just said it. See, he's always on my side. He just told me not to give up. And I'm not going to give up. So I don't think I should quit YouTube. Oh, that's good. <laughs> that's good. So I don't know. So what else are we going to talk to YouTube about today? Okay. Uh What about... Um, we could talk about the screaming child in the background that's like messing up our video. Listen to that. It don't make no sense. He's up there playing video games and we're down here trying to talk and we can't talk. So we could do, uh, I guess, how we met. You want to start there? Well, you can start it. Why do I got to start there? Well, because you might have a different out... Uh, well, I did. we did meet on a, a, a dating website. It was called Black People Meet, right? Or was it called Black People Channel? What was it called? Black People Meet. Black People Meet. So, it took what? It took us only what four or five days, and we ended up meeting that that week or something like that. I don't know. But ever since I met him, he was the sweetest guy. He never changed. Oh, is that so? Seven years ago, right? Yeah, that's about right. Seven years ago. <laughs> Seven years ago, and we were we've been married for. Five years? Don't punch me, please don't punch me, because I, I I got I know I got it right right for yeah, it's about something like that. Years. Yeah, and it didn't take us long to be to get married either. It took us what um, after only knowing each other for a month, probably like two months, and we're still we here. Got, what? We only knew each other for about a good two months. Oh yeah, I don't think it's about that. Well, see, sometimes you gotta understand something. God will put two people in a certain place, and if it's meant to be, it'll be. Mm -hmm. He will show you signs. He will give you that direction. He will guide you a certain way. Mm -hmm. And once he guides you, it's up to you. You know, uh, you know the Bible it says if you take one step, God will take two. Mm -hmm. You know, and then you, what you have to do, you have to know the signals, the signs. You have to know everything to surround that situation. True. And if you don't. If you don't, you lose out on something special. Yeah, and I'm glad I didn't. I, cause there was a point too where you were about to move in. And I was like, no, nah, I don't want. I don't think you should move in. And you kept calling and saying, you know, I, you are the one I'm who I want to be with. And I was like, ah, oh, let's give us some time and stuff like that. But guess what? If I would kept it going, you wouldn't be sitting here today. Hmm. Yeah, you missed out on a good thing. And he takes care of you guys. He, he huh. takes care of you. The car that I drive, the clothes I wear, the hairstyles that I wear, the nails. Never always talk about my nails in my videos. It's this guy here. <laughs> but you know, let me tell you something about that. When I first met you, right? I, I questioned myself. Right? I didn't question God. I questioned myself. And so I said, you know what? If it's meant to be, I'm going to do something. So I did this. 
craziest thing. I had a can of peas. I never forget because I can't stand peas. So I, I had this uh, I had this table, right? I just bought. Um, it was like a uh, oh man, what is it called? A, to think, a barbell table, mm-hmm. right? Which was just like brown and tan. This story is great. So I put the t- I put the can of peas on the table side up with. I mean, even if a burst of wind came through, they wouldn't knock over the peas. So I'm asleep one night, and I go in, and I hear the sound. And I was like, what's going on? Something's in the kitchen. So I get up, go to the kitchen, hear the peas on the floor. <laughs> so I go out my door in front my, my front yard. I come back up the steps, look all over my, my apartment. Nobody was there. Uh, matter of fact, I was living alone there, you know. So nobody was there. So I'm sitting up and I'm looking at the can of peas. <laughs> and that's how I knew that it was God giving me a son. Now most people might think, oh that's crazy. It's the truth. But there's no other explanation. So I said, you know what? Mm-hmm. It is what it is. And I noticed too, I don't mean to cut you off, like it was a time when you were home at your place. And uh, I said, I came home, the kids were in school, I just got out of work, and it was really quiet in the house, you had just went back, and I was like, that's to see how it feels to be apart. And I, I felt it, when I sat there alone, I looked around, it was quiet, I was like, wait a minute, my man's not here, I, I need him here. Mm-hmm. And that's when I knew, like, in my heart that I needed him, and he was there ever since. So. Very interesting. Yeah, it's true. You've been there ever, ever since. Like you've never changed. Well, I don't change. You don't change. Yeah, so I was. Yeah. He's all about making money, you guys. So he's like the money maker over here. And whatever whatever he does, he makes sure that I'm okay and the family's okay. Everything's running right. I have no worries over here. No worries. This this guy. Good, good. <laughs> That's a good thing. So. You know, you're supposed to be appreciated in life. You know, if you have somebody special, you know, it don't have to be about us. It could be it could be about anybody, anybody that that you're supposed to be appreciated. And if you're not appreciated, then there's something wrong with the relationship. Yeah. You know, yeah. just like a relationship, you know, if you look around your house and you're with somebody and you don't see that one thing that this person has bought to, uh, I would say, contribute to your home, right, that means there's something wrong. If you look at your credit from where or you started the relationship to, to this point on or from your last relationship, and you don't see a change, or you see a, a, a drop in your score, there's only one problem. That, that relationship wasn't meant to be. You know, if you're in a good, good, good relationship, your score should be higher than what you came in at. Yeah, when I first met him, it, my score was what, 480, something like that? That was 435. Four, okay, well, he remembers. Okay, he remembers. I don't. But it was still bad, and I didn't even know about credit. I was like 18, I didn't even, not 18, how old was I when I met you? 20. Well, I don't know why I went back to 18, but whatever. I'm 34 now, 35. I gotta get my numbers right. <laughs> but now my credit's up to what, 680, 685, almost 700, because he worked on it. He worked on my credit, and everything's looking good. Credit cards, everything's paid on time. He new makes sure car. new car. He makes sure everything is going new house. Good. Yeah, everything looks good. So, so when you look at a relationship. It's based on the surroundings of it. Don't look how, you know, uh, I'll tell you what, most people look at uh, how long they've been together. That that means nothing without success. Mm -hmm. If you don't have success in the time, you don't have success in your credit, you don't have success in your financial values, there's going to be a problem. Mm-hmm. You know, and eventually the problem is gonna, you know, occur. You know, bad things happen in a relationship, but it has to be balanced out. Uh, we're pretty much balanced. You know, a lot of things that yeah. I don't like, he doesn't like. Like we don't really like like animals. We don't smoke. You know, I might have a couple bottles of wine here and there, which is fine for me. And he he's okay with wine. I'm just not about falling out in the street, falling out in the grass somewhere, tripping over things. No, but it's just a lot of similarities here, right? A yeah. lot. So, I don't know. He's not loud. I'm not loud. We're very... It's a baby. <laughs> I'm not loud. He's not loud. We're just very... We just really click together. And that's how it is. Like, we just... 
we're both homebodies. Like we'll do, we'll go places here and there. We just love, we don't like staying long at certain places. We don't like crowds. This is how we are, and I like it about you. I love that. Not like it about you. I love that about you. <laughs> what's the, what's the time we got? We're going, it's, uh, it's already at 10 minutes, but we're going to stop the video because I don't think YouTube lets me go over 15 minutes, so I don't want to make the video too long. But um, we're going to start doing videos like this. Yeah, I guess we can do that. Yeah, we can start doing videos like this. So, Everybody, okay. have a nice night, and make sure you come back and watch some more of our videos. Anything you got to say? Uh, I think that's about it. Until next time. <laughs> All right, see you later.